Yo, welcome to the very first video on the Jake Cashin channel. And if you guys read the bio on my channel, you know that I'm a huge soccer fan. I'm a fan of the Scotland national team, obviously. We're doing decent in the World Cup qualifiers right now, as I'm part Scottish, and also I'm an Aston Villa fan. And in this first video, we're going to be taking a look at the match day four games um, as they just ended, but we have not seen Leeds and Liverpool play in Everton and Burnley. But jumping into the first game, Crystal Palace versus Tottenham. Crystal Palace puts Tottenham Hotspur down. Um, nothing on the board for Tottenham. And in the 12th minute, there's a substitute. Ooh, Wilfred Zaha scores, putting, it, putting them on the board in the 76th minute. And then we have... Odsino Edward, and then after that we have oh Odsino Edward on the board again. Arsenal and Norwich, as you guys know, Arsenal have hasn't been doing too well in the Prem League, um, but they do um, not really an upset, but they do defeat Norwich City. Um, Arsenal obviously should have won, and they did, but um, yeah. Um, after that, we have Brighton and Brentford. Brighton, you know, they're sitting in the top four in the Champions League spot. Brentford not doing too well. Um, not much going on in this match. Brighton easily should have won that. Trossard putting it away for them. Manchester City closing down Leicester. And then we have Silva scoring for Man City. Ooh, some yellow cards happening in this game. But here is the game that we are most excited about. Man U setting down Newcastle. Ronaldo obviously having a great game. Cristiano Ronaldo scoring in the 62nd minute. Bruno Fernandez, And then we have Jesse Lingard coming up on the board again. Southampton and West Ham United tie. This is going to put... Each team's in the conference league. I don't. I think one team might be in relegation. Watford and Wanderers, and Watford and the Wolves. Um, Watford, obviously, losing to this team. It's funny because Aston Villa. We lost to Watford in the first game. I think three to two. Also, congratulations to Danny Ings for winning match day of or for winning, um, goal of the month. And then the final match that was played today, Chelsea and Aston Villa. I don't think in the predictions, 96% of people were wanting Aston Villa to, or were predicting that Chelsea would win, and around 4% were saying that Aston Villa would win. I think we all knew the result of this game, but a disappointing loss for Aston Villa, as we were sitting in a decent spot for our team. Because we had a lot of great signings um, with all the money that we had available. We signed Danny Ings, and um, he actually just won goal of the month, like I just said. But Chelsea putting away Aston Villa. Yep, Kovacic scoring. And then in the 15 minutes, you have Lukuka. And then, yeah, we're, we're subbing out John McGinn early. Danny Ings coming into the pitch for Triore. Triore should be in the starting lineup. John McGinn gets a yellow card. Um, he's on my all-time favorite um, player because he is a Scot. He's a Scottish player. Kickoff Liverpool versus Leeds. Liverpool should put this one away. Leeds, I think, is in relegation. Everton and Burnley. Ooh, this kickoff is at 12. Everton should win. But we don't know. That's that should be a pretty pretty even matchup. But two big games that were played today in match day five or m match day four. Sorry, we're obviously Man U in Newcastle. Man U really putting it away for Newcastle. I think that's a great home game that Man U really needed. Um, Ronaldo obviously had a great performance. Yeah, but that is going to be it. Um, right now, we're going to be taking a look at – no, that is going to be it, actually. Um, yeah, so thanks for watching the first video. I hope you enjoyed it. Leave down some comments below. Make sure to check out the bio so you know what videos are to come. And if you want to see more of these videos where I predict Prem Leagues or react to all the scores, um, yeah, maybe Prem League match day five.
prediction video could come out soon. Um, yeah, that was a very fun video to film. Hope you guys enjoyed it and see it in the next.